Hey, what's going on guys? This is Mast, and before we dive into the video, I want to do a quick little shout out to myself and to Smite 2, because hi -Rez just released the Smite 2 Founders Edition pre-order today, so if you guys want to get it, you can get it from the same price from my Nexus store and contribute to me at the same time if you'd like to. Not going to push you to, but if you'd like to, figured I'd shout it out because uh, I like money. So yeah, moving into the video. Hey, what's going on guys? This is Mast and welcome back to some more Predecessor. This time we are in for a mirror match against somebody with some sort of skin. So I don't know if he knows what he's doing. Um, he might. He doesn't have like a master skin. He just has a skin. So maybe he just thought it looked cool. It does look cool to be fair. It's like a white tiger or something. It's got like a cool ass helmet on. I have no helmet on because I know how handsome I am. You know this guy's uggo underneath. We might be twins. You know something happened in the womb. He is not as sexy as me. And we're going to see it in the laning phase as I get bopped. Okay, I'm giving up clear, but we maybe take a little bit less poke. Don't know if that's good. We are somehow out clearing. I don't know how that happened. Wait, are we out clearing? I think it's kind of the same. I think it's similar. Um, We'll have to see if there's a build diff in this lane. Yeah, we're getting a little bit out cleared here. And then we'll do a little dip. That was pretty even. We're like a few HP under or whatever. Are we building the same? We are not. We are not. So that might be the plus for me. I am going Fire Blossom. We're actually going to go a tank build. Greystone is the guy that I put a lot of time in, and I have built him like a potato so far. So I thought for this video, it might be interesting. I think that was a good jump. Um, for this video, I thought it might be... Yeah, we get a little bit... Oh, he's got a jump as well, huh? So we just sit here blocking each other's autos and then bonking each other down. Okay, what if I don't clear, and then what if I jump on your face, and then what if I win this trade super hard and run him? What if I do all of that? Boom, get warded. I think this ward is terrible and does very little, but it does at least maybe do a little bit, maybe. I don't know. We're running Oom. Yeah, mana so far has felt like a problem for me with Greystone. Not sure if that is a normal thing. This man opted to back, huh? Do I stop hitting wave here to let it slow clear a little more? Like, I think I even try and last hit a little bit later so they'll push out more. And then I think we speed clear this. And then we go back to base. I think this is a good play. Yeah. And then we should probably get away with this. I'll dip down here, but we're actually just going to be going back. Not sure if we're going to be getting a farm lead on him over that or not. And we're not going to be getting this done. Oh, he's trolling me. Buddy, you're missing farm, man. Can't be good. I don't think he. I don't think he even wins this. I'm just beating on him. <laughs> huh? That was that was an interesting play. I'd assume there would be a gank to go with that, and there doesn't seem to be. So we're gonna just be clearing here. Interesting. Yeah, he does get a regen because he went back for for pots, but I think he sort of trolled himself. Get a little bit of free damage on him. Again, try and go back. We'll see what he does this time around. I can't look around this. Are you going to stop my back again? No. And this time we get Brimstone. I think by canceling my back, I think he just devastated himself. That might be that might be coming on a little strong. I think he hurt himself a lot. Because now I'm getting my T2 little baby mystical, which is a great power spike. And then I think I'm getting a farm lead um, in this lane. Not really all that much because of stopping the bank, but just I think basically the way that we farmed before that was just better. I mean, right now we still have farm lead and I'm getting back to lane. So, I think we're looking good. It looks like he did green, but I don't really care. Or, what's it called? Cyan? I think it's Cyan. Oops. I literally just missed my auto. We'll try and do the boring zone thing here. Although I am mystical the wave. There's probably tech where I'm supposed to, like, not let the wave push by running up to last hit and then kind of leave it like this a little bit. I don't know how much it actually matters, though. Maybe we should ward. Do a little something. I'm assuming, by the way, I'll probably end up... I'm recording a bunch of videos on this day, and then I'm going to be uploading them over the next few days, and I'll have comments, and then I won't be learning anything because it hasn't actually been... <laughs> the stuff you guys are seeing, time hasn't actually passed. It just gets uploaded later on. But I'm assuming... Hang on. Sir. Okay, yeah. Yeah, you know what? This is making me feel good about this lane. I think that's just a skin. I don't think it's a skin diff. I think it's just a skin. 
literally, by the time this video goes up, people might be like, Mass, you are overthinking this skin thing. <laughs> it's so funny because I've played Smite so long. I'm that guy where it's like, like every once in a while, somebody will be like, oh, they have, they have diamond something. It, it doesn't even have to be the skin. It could be like the straight up border. Be like, oh, they have diamond Morrigan. I'll be like, bro, it does not mean anything. It means so little. But meanwhile, this guy has a recolor and I'm like, uh oh, I'm going to get clapped. I know what's coming. Uh, can I yoink this without trolling him? Probably not. He's going to do red buff. I want to go do smalls near him. So I have something to do with my time, but I think we just sit here and wait a little bit. Okay, I already have one word here. Anyways, what I was going to say is I think I'm probably going to get advice toward on the buffs because I've figured out uh, in my head a little bit over over the last game, over the... Actually, I don't know what order I'll upload it in, so I won't spoil what I played last game, but... um. I think I figured out that warding on buffs, especially early game, is probably realistically the best way to ward. If you can manage to get a ward on their blue or on their smalls, something like that, you can kind of tell that they're going to be incoming, and you can detect it way in advance. That's been my assumption. I do think we just simply wail on him here. Unfortunately, I did miss jump. Yeah, it's seeming like mystical, even though it's just... uh. The baby version does just auto win our trades right now because I fought him through the wave. I feel like I probably was getting more beat up by minions there. But we're just tank here and we do free damage, so I think it's good. Right now he's got this. Oh, he's got a bit of a shred item. That's kind of interesting. So he might be going first item. I think it's called Basilisk. It's maybe bad that I'm pushing this. I'm not sure. Oh, he's backing. No, it might be really good that I'm pushing this. Uh, I want to make sure I get the last hit on that. And I think we get this. How much money do we need? Decent amount more. Yeah, so I want to say if I get the chance, I should check. Basilisk is a really cool looking item. And I know it's really strong on this guy. Um, unless I've misinterpreted it. But I'm assuming this is why it's recommended on him. Is that his Q, which is like kind of like an Arthur spin, but you can actually auto attack during it. It's like you do a lot of tick damage. Um, not overall crazy damage, but like you're frequently procking it. Like each thing will do... Um, like, first prot shred, and then percent HP. By the way, something I know from experience with the Greystone matchup, or at least, <laughs> I guess I still don't know it yet, I've assumed. Greystone passive, you, like, block the first auto that you take in a while. It might even be instant damage, can I tell? Yeah, the next auto, every 11.4 seconds. I don't know what's making it 11.4. Um, so normally we want to land an auto, which I thought I did, but it looks like he just proc passive. Okay, he might be goofing here. I've got flash. Okay, and then I ult on top. Okay, I think he might have jumped that, but I think we're still just killing him someday. Get as much of a body block as I can. Nice. That's what we like to see. Yeah, um... So I'll talk about Greystone Kit in a second. Because we did some stuff there, and I think... While I sort of played it better, I think in a way he actually played it better. Like, I killed him. <laughs> I killed him because I played it overall better, but he actually did something good there that I probably should have done myself. So let's get this. And then I don't know. I think I'm just going to peek recommended here. I think we'll just go Basilisk because I think this is super strong on us. We're just going to start the, the Fire Blossom. I'm also not sure. I think we're going to be leveling the E. That's what I've been doing so far, but I could be wrong on doing it. I'm actually landing a lot of jumps right now, so it might be good to level jump if we're if we're landing them. So let's talk about the kit a little bit. Passive I already talked about. I don't remember if there's more to it. Oh, that's right. When we're kind of just landing, um, I think it's just damage because I think our Q procs it. We're just gaining power. It's a little bit like a Thor passive type thing, but different. We're just kind of getting stronger forehead. Um, our Q, pretty simple. It's a spin to win. If you're dealing damage during it, I don't know if it has to be extended through autos or if you just have to land it. Okay, it does have to be autos. You can make it last for longer. So I want to say it lasts like four-ish seconds by default, but you can make it like seven. Um, and it's looking like it hits a little harder than it does because we have Fire Blossom here. This guy just AFK'd from lane, I guess. He's just over there ganking. So I will push this. Don't know what Buddy is doing. I don't know if that's just tilt or what, but <laughs> I don't think it's good. <laughs> like, it's a little early to be making a big rotation like this. I don't know if my team wants me to rotate, but I basically don't care. It seems like they might, because I think their team is pressuring Fangtooth, it looks like. But I feel like it, it can't be worth, can it? I don't think it's good. Because I think we just get a little tower here and a stupid amount of farm. Yeah, they got Fangtooth. I think that's okay. But maybe I don't know. 
Maybe I lack information. Anyways, yeah, Q pretty simple. The E is pretty simple. We enhance our next three autos to do bonus damage and slow. Um, and then our jump is kind of like a Fenner jump minus the stun, where it does damage, it doesn't have crazy range, and then you reset the cooldown a little bit if you land it. But only a little bit. It's like 25-30%, something like that. And then our ult is pretty sick, but I think it's kind of a noob trap ability. Um, it's like it's like Emir's dream ult, where you charge up this big landing, you go into stasis, which is basically like CC Munagus, uh, heal a bunch of a percentage of your missing health, which can be up to like half of your health. Are we going to fight, man? He's acting like he might fight here. And then do a big dunk down that does a bunch of damage. I don't, if I remember right, it doesn't CC. Okay, I don't know why we're jumping in place. I feel like that's questionable at best. Oh, oops. I did not time that right. That time, ironically, I actually should have just ulted too, because he already jumped on me. Okay, he has flash, that's okay. Um, <laughs> ironically, the thing I'd been thinking I should have done last time would have worked perfect last time. The thing I did this time was the exact wrong thing to do this time. This time I should have just ulted on him because he didn't have jump. Last time, he juked my ult by just jumping. Because normally, you know, this, this is an ability, like a lot of abilities in Smite, where if you're trading, same way like you trade jumps in Smite, Whoever jumps second just wins, because the other one's going to land, and then you land on them. So, we basically have that with our ultimate, but that time I that time I actually should have just ulted on him. He didn't have a way to juke it, other than blink, maybe. <clears throat> That's okay. We still get a bully. Okay, this is seeming very greedy. I still have everything. He did a little bit juke me. So he might just simply get to tower and be fine. Honestly, I guess I think he gets to tower and is just fine anyways. Oh my god. You hear that? I'm flicking too hard. My sense is too low. Clink in my mug. Man, I wish that was up. We get a little greedy. I have ult. I think I can just do some stuff here. Okay, so I believe we can go back for our starter upgrade here if we want. Uh, I kind of want to stick around. No, this is getting way too greedy. I'm going to dip. I got a lot of money to spend. I'm being so greedy. Like, I can ult for HP, but you know what? No, I'm going to do it anyways. I don't care. We're going to stick around. I got no pots, but I got an ult. I will bank after this, though. Smack. 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 Oh, yeah. Yeah, we like to see that. I don't remember if leveling ult is good. It might not be worth... Okay, we'll work on our Basilisk a little bit more. Uh, I think this is a pretty good looking spot to potentially rotate. And maybe not. Because <laughs> they're, they're kind of far away. It's going to be hard to get there. Just like I have plenty of farm right now. I want to do something with it. We do maybe get a gank mid. But I don't think I get to do anything left. By the way, with our ultimate tower diving, gets a lot easier. Um... Because we can regen damage that we're taking. Ooh. Ooh. Psych. Hang on. We're going to get sneaky with it. We're going to get a little bit sneaky with it. What's up, mama? Do I need all this? I do not. I do not one bit. By the way, apparently we could not yet upgrade this. Unfortunate. Ooh, it's a Grux. Hey, bud. Get jumped on. Okay, I am a tanky man, so other than getting ganked, I think we're fine here. I got jump. Okay. Don't think I'm ever getting away from this, so I'm just going to try and do what damage I can. Okay, I maybe could have gotten away from it. Okay, I maybe just did anyways. Shoutouts to my Grim. <laughs> what the hell was that? <laughs> Bro tried to snipe! Okay, do not catch me lazy banking. That's right, just kill my teammate. Uh, we're getting thorns type thing. I don't remember if I've actually built this before, so this will feel a little weird. I think Overlord is okay? Eh. Uh, hmm. Let's go recommended build here. What does this do? This seems solid. This seems solid. Let's go with this. Is it just Fizzy though? It's just Fizzy slash damage, so it is Bruisery. 
Yeah, I gotta look up again. It's been either forever or I've literally never built this one. I built it. I just kind of peeped the build um, and they recommended this. I know there's also one I was forgetting about. It lets you heal more in your ult, but this one seems more fun. There's one that's kind of like a min maxi. Your ult healing's insane in this buff's healing type thing. So yeah, we do. Basically, we get tank here. And then when we activate it, we gain a big chunk of armor and we reflect damage like uh, like thorns. And it is pre-mitigated damage, so it's capable of being a lot. Oh, hi. Uh, this is getting a little cringe. I am so dead. I guess I'll pop this, but I don't think it's doing much of anything. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Somebody had a grudge. <laughs> I. That was so random. All right. Return to lane, immediately get three-man ganked. I wonder if these guys are actually in comms or if that just somehow happened. Because that seemed very in comms, like, hey guys, the moment Greystone gets back, we are clapping his cheeks. But maybe it was just for some reason they were there. They were, like, splitting buffs or something. I don't know. By the way, Zaris, I think, seems like a potentially cool character. But so far, every person I've seen play him, at least against me, um... Wow, this guy is big brain. This guy's cooking. Everybody I've seen play him against me, I feel like is super cringe and lame, um, which honestly syncs up a lot with his smite counterpart, Odin. Odin is, well, no, Odin just actually is cringe. I'm gonna be honest. I've even played some of him recently. Now he's just, he's really cringe. Um, <laughs> but yeah, I feel like he's a character that's kind of cool. He's got this Colosseum ult that like traps people in basically like Odin ult. And then um, he can get an, inf I think it's infinite, hypothetically, like power scale off of it, where like each person he kills in his ult gives him five or ten power or something. So if you somehow go crazy with him, you can get a stupid amount, which I think is a cool concept. Okay, I want to punish these guys if I can. And I can. Enjoy being dead. It's what you get for cringe ganking. Well, sort of. For maybe calling, for I don't know if he called for it. <laughs> for maybe making me get cringe ganked. Oh, he thinks he gets to do this. Uh, we'll do a little of this. Do not CC me, please. Hey, hey, don't make me ult. You're gonna make me ult. You're gonna make me ult. Shit. He did the thing. He did the res thing. Is this hitter up there? Uh oh. Okay, that's his flash. Oh, I wanted to slow him. That's too bad. I think we're... Do I die to dot? I die to dot. I'm, I'm assuming my boy gets a kill eventually here, since he flashed. Yeah, it's too bad. We got a... Don't remember if we ever got his ultimate there, but we got... Like, we basically towered over him, and then he rezzed under tower, which, like, super hard countered what I was trying to do with my ult. So, <laughs> I don't think there was too much we could do other than just be more aware of starter items, which will take some time. That's okay. If stupid what's-her-face didn't show up, it would have been fine, too. Morigesh. Okay, I'm kind of feeling the damage more as we work on this. Getting a little more of that online. Like, come on, one defense item has got to be enough. Although I will say me going thorns is probably actively getting more and more troll the more damage slash bruiser I build compared to just straight up tank. I don't know. Actually, eventually this is a pretty tanky item. It's just not yet. Okay, I think working on our farm again might be a good idea. Because I think as of late, this has been one of the lowest farm games I've had. We are out farming everybody, especially in CS, my god. Um, but only by a little bit. And I feel like if it wasn't for basically the moment I got ganked, just like immediately not going back to lane and instead of just ganking again. Like there's been a good five minutes of basically no farming for us, I think. So, so let's actually do a little. So this character Greystone, I believe, is a pretty bad late game character. Um... Maybe that's a weird way of putting it. I don't think he's remotely a hyper carry. I don't think he's that type of guy. Something something worth considering if you want to play him yourself. I do think he's probably fine late game, but he's kind of a weird character for me to be playing. 
because I honestly think, even though I've actually sunk the most time into him, I think he's very much not the type of character I would play in Smite. And now that I've experimented with characters that I think are more fun, I probably won't play him much in the future. But I thought I owed a video having a... Uh, having played him this much anyways. Oh, of course we're getting ganked. Okay, our ult should be kind of neat here, but I'm assuming we're just dying anyways. Uh, do I kill? That was close. I don't know if he was just holding his ult that hard, or if for some reason it was down. Yeah, these guys have to be queued, man. They're consistently doing these three-man ganks on me for some reason so late in the game. So, maybe I instead don't farm and I just go rotate with my team and we win the game, because... I don't think they get to remotely do this if we actually have a similar number of people. And it's annoying me a little bit that, <laughs> that right now we're just consistently just getting out rotated on stuff. You're gonna make me try, man. You don't want that. Mast, when he actually looks at map, is a different breed. Yeah, I think we'll do that. I think we'll go rotate with team. Try and stack on objectives. I'm gonna start pinging objectives. I'm gonna be like, do the mini prime. Even though it's probably not mini anymore. I don't know when it swaps. Ooh, yeah, she's looking to gank over in left lane. No, you're not. You're not doing that one bit. Nice try, buddy. This guy has caught up a little bit. Three and three, you have got to be kidding me. Ooh, you just dying anyways. Put her down. Hello. Okay, I did not yoink that, right? I believe, which is neat. You know, considering I did almost nothing there. Okay, this guy's actually pushing. And I can't ping it. Wait, can I ping it now? Did I change this? Defend right lane. Whoa, VGS is insane. <laughs> I don't know if I actually should have backed there now. This guy's kind of behind, so I don't know if it's even a good idea for him to defend. I just, I am just assuming that if I go to defend, here comes the gank. Morigash spawns and runs right over. But we might get a kill. Hang on, we try again. Attack right lane. Okay, just kidding. How do I... Shit. Be to close. Oh, that's not what I meant. Oh my god, he's actually trying to attack. Bro, this poor guy is getting so trolled by my scuff EGS. This is the first time it's worked. I feel so bad. <laughs> He's getting so trolled. I said attack right lane. I wanted to undo it. I got lost on how to undo it. Um, it's because I wanted to cancel that instead of retreat. If I just looked for retreat, I would have found that. Smite has a more complex, a more intricate VGS. That's so funny, man. <laughs> that he actually, he was actually such a homie. And here I am just sitting here farming after telling him to go in. It's okay, he didn't die. He just also wanted to go on him. Uh, we will be rotating. They are doing some sort of team fighting over there. I do have a big item I could get done, though. Or maybe a big invade. Okay, that's fair. Nice. Let's see, hang on, hang on, hang on. Attack? Ooh! Hold up! Oh, and they're like, group up, group up, group up! Mast made the call! Mast said attack Fangtooth! That is not what they're thinking at all, but... That's crazy! It's actually so fitting that I rebound this to V. It was really just coincidence since I'd rebound my, uh... Like, since I made C my potions. Nice, we get to be Zoomy. That's way better than dumbass... What's the jungle one? Buffs last longer? Who cares? I think that's what it is. I want a little bit. I want a little bit. Okay, you know what? Is it gonna be like that, huh? Smack. Is it really gonna be like that? Let's see if this guy pushes up. Get a little 1v1 for ourselves. What is Infernum? Oh, speaking of which, he's actually in the jungle there. I will read item in the meantime. Oh my god, what? Wait, this looks broken on me. Slash him. I didn't know this item existed. Unless I am missing something. Oop. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna say it. Infernum diff. Is that what happened? Probably not, but <laughs> looks like that item's insane. Yeah, so it looks like... Oh, maybe this is once per ability. I was thinking it might be once per tick. 
If it is once per tick, this seems disgusting. If it's once per tick, it seems like you're basically getting an auto attack's worth of damage every three ticks. Uh, which is filthy, because th these are a lot of ticks, right? Like a tick is, I think, at least as often, or three ticks is at least as often as an auto, I think. By the way, I just proxied this guy a little bit. I did not realize, I'm sorry. Okay, I do kind of want to kill her, though. I have a lot of money to spend. It would be good to go back. Maybe we murder her face. Maybe we get to... Do you know? She does not know. She does not know one bit. She is busy dying. I'm just going to preemptively thorns in case it gives us bonus damage. Yeah, have some thorns back. Have some thorns back. I feel kind of bad that we got killed there. Maybe I should have stopped doing damage. Because it means he doesn't get to level his uh, his power up. Like that one. That one's not even like a, a fake last hit. That one actually matters for him. It's actually a long term scaling. I wanted to. Hi. Yeah, I wanted to get in there a little bit. Oh, we can't. Oop. Thought that would jump that. Nice. This guy's dead. All right. All right, boys. I might have overthought this. I was going to go try and cut her off. Yeah, they just killed her. <laughs> All right, do we get to push this? Do we have minions? Yeah. Whatever. I'm dipping. By the way, tower not hitting that hard since we're a little bit tanky. I think this is the tankiest game I've had. Okay, we do have a little bit of minions. Do we actually get a push? They're kind of dead. Try and let our support get in there. Yeah, I think this guy's about to end. Because we can slow him a bit. I'm going to commit really hard for this. Because I think we're just chilling in the end. Like, I don't know. Maybe I baited my support. Yeah, maybe I baited my support. Is there Grim Fed? It looked like he got a little deleted there. Let's see if we get to lurk this. Oh, we do. What's up, buddy? Oh, who's running Oom? Um? Oh, wait. He still kills my guy. <laughs> wait. <laughs> Well, I tried. <laughs> Shit, I wonder if I jumped on him if I could have saved him. I didn't expect that. I really didn't think he'd hit that hard that fast. All right, we buy a lot of items here. I am going to be looking up... Where is it? Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Buy a little Infernum. Yeah, let me stare at this item some more. Damaging abilities in base Gadax apply stack of kindling to target. I still can't tell. Okay, I don't know. This is a, uh, I think jungle practice would help a lot for figuring out this item. Or a YouTube comment. Comment down below to teach Mast how to play the game. To inform me how things work. Yeah, I think either way it's good. It's just in one, in one scenario it's like unbelievably broken. And then the other it's just really good. Is I feel like <laughs> how this item is looking on Greystone. Because we do just, you know... We do, we do have a decent amount of damaging abilities to pop it, and we do auto attack quite a bit while we use them, so. Either way, we're going to go it. Okay, by the way, magic defense soon, probably going to be good. I believe Grimm's... We are getting ganked. We are gone. Um, Stop. <laughs> He's still running at me. I wonder if we can... Hang on, hang on, we do it again! Oh, I tried to actually VGS that one. Camps, Fangtooth. Oh, I think they're calling it too. Did I call it first? Shit. It's okay. I had the idea first. You're dead. You're dead. Dare you to blink, Bozo? Dare you to try and see what happens? Yep. You're next? Oh my god, this one is getting chunked. I thought that was support. I don't know if it's support. Yeah, we just go hunting right now. Build online. Oh, I thought that would go farther. Yeah, I don't care. Come here. Come on. Let's fight. Oh, I thought he'd stun there. Thought we'd get a clean little immune on him. Uh, speaking of which, I think he entered. Oh, I mistimed that really bad. Oops. Okay, well... I goofed that a pretty good bit. Oh my god, that guy is chonking. He is ADC, so that makes sense. 
Oh my god, there's so many minions. <laughs> is this, did somebody pull every minion wave? What happened? What is this? I don't know if we get to punish any of these guys. I really want to, but he's like in Titan. Yeah, we should probably... Hang on. Uh, shit. I wanted to call retreat. But I think they're maybe killing this guy. Oh, hold up! That's a big stun! We can work with the big stun! I don't even know whose stun that was. They do a little dying. Guys, can I get some kills too? I want to feel special. Ma'am? Okay, can she is support, by the way. Because she does that. What the hell? <laughs> that was sick! Come here! <laughs> I've never seen somebody juke like that. Yeah, that's my first. Get the hell back here, woman! Wait, we actually might catch her someday. Hang on. Yeah, put her down! Nice, that's game. <laughs> that was a funny little juke. I'm assuming she did that on purpose. I'm not totally sure. She acted like it. She played it pretty smooth. I gotta see, did I do stupid damage that game? We didn't get a stupid amount of kills, but we got a lot of assists. And I feel like we definitely contributed a lot to anything that I actually was a part of. God, our ADC was popping. 14 and 4? He probably did stupid damage. Oh no, I did stu Okay, I did stupid damage. Wow, we did 31k. That is a lot. Yeah, nice, good game. A little 17k? Keep up, buddy. That's gonna be my skin. Um, yeah, I get a lot- <laughs> I'm mostly joking with it. I actually am getting genuinely more competitive since it's a new game. I feel like, like, trying to get good at it means something to me since it's new. It's been an incredibly long time since I've played a game like this, other than a little bit Tarkov when I got to get a Tarkov, but you guys didn't get to see that um, when I started grinding that, where, where I'm actually, I'm partially getting more competitive, or I want to beat people and like feel like I'm better than them, but I also just think it's fun to shit talk as a noob in a game when it has no meaning, so it's a mix of both. Um, <laughs> but thank you guys for watching, hopefully you all enjoyed the video, and I will see you all in the next one. I've been seeking for the glory Say, say, say my name And I've been trying to write my own story In the search for fame I'm sitting here in this empty room Walls keep tumbling down